all safe and sound, retrieve the bear bag. Good morning, I'm Lefty and welcome to Best of the Backroads. I'm the first up this morning, it's uh, 717. We stayed at a great campground, no fire did come, there were no bears, and I've got my cup of coffee. It's gonna be a good day. Rocky Mountain Scramble gets a B. <laughs> it is a B meal. It's okay. Uh, last night, what we have last night? Beef, um, Beef stroganoff, stroganoff with mushrooms. Yep. That, that was, was an good. A meal. That is an A meal on the backpacker menu. This is probably a B meal. Um, luckily we're hungry, so it's a B plus. The plan, we're packed up and the plan for the day is to finish the 10 miles in uh, section three here, get fuel for the bikes, water for ourselves, and then we tackle section two, which is uh, a highlight of the trip, we hope. It's got Cinnamon Pass, California Pass, and Ophir Pass. Been a long chase, but at last I'm free. These open woods, I knew I could find peace here. Nothing like the city where I got tired of the running, the catching up. I got hungry for the stunning high mountain tops. So I made some plans, some dreams to catch, to promise lands, to find my path. The ride? Yeah. Oh man, this is incredible. Once we started coming up Cinnamon Pass, oh, I love this road. This is great. And the reason you don't see a lot of film of it is it's too hard to film uh, because it's a little rocky. Super fun to ride, hard to film. Forks, and uh, this was a couple years ago. Was the top three things to see by Outdoor Magazine? It's okay. It's a ghost town. Let's. Uh, I'll show you guys a house over here. Yeah, just a ghost town. And uh, I'm betting oh. All these buildings are kind of like that. Let me show you one more. And uh, so Cinnamon Pass kind of kicked my ass. I had two drops. One drop was uh, the first drop. I just uh, slid on some loose rock, front end went down and then I hit my knee. And the second drop was stupidity from the first drop because I, uh, I didn't gun it as much as I should have. Um, up here at the higher elevations, there's less horsepower in the motorcycle, and uh, that proved my undoing. So I've dumped twice, probably within 500 yards or less, um, and then came down off the mountain. All right, here we go, another ghost town. Oh, wow. This one has windows. That's cool. I wonder if there's something spooky upstairs.
Animus Forks. I said Animus Falls earlier, but it's Animus Forks. Uh, we're not too far from Telluride right now. We're gonna head out uh, back up a mountain and give it some more. Yeah. Some plants, some dreams to catch, some promised lands to find a path, see the planet from greater heights. Okay, folks, this does not look steep on film, but trust me, this is steep. Mike is super nervous about this. Go, Mike, go, 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 go. There's no power. No power on the DR. You just don't have the power to make it up. We're such, we're so high that the carbureted bike is kind of giving out. No power. No power. Okay. Well. Yeah, there's not. I mean, I'm. Okay. Well, yeah. Mike, what do you think, buddy? I think I don't. I mean, I can't get it up there, and I can't push it up. We cannot push it up. I mean, there's no power there. No power. So I guess we're gonna have to call it. Right, Mike? We're kind I mean, of just. I don't think we can get up there on California Pass. I don't think so either. I mean. Wait a minute, is this Engineer Pass? This is California. Oh, this is California Pass. Yeah. I mean, there's no power. I'm giving it. The little DR is having a little trouble. We are too, as far as that matters. I mean, any. Whoa! <laughs> you do not. You don't understand how steep this is. It's been kind of a harder day than we expected on the trail. Yes. And uh, so we popped in for some real food for the first time in a couple days. At the, yeah, Golden Brock Brewery. Anyway, it's a nice place. And we're, we're seated by the door. We have an eye on our bikes and the food looks delicious. And of course, you gotta have your Coors Light because you're in the Rocky Mountains. Or the local brew. If you can all hear me on this video, we didn't get to California, but shit, two out of three. Mom said that ain't bad. No big deal. We're having a good time. We're camping a second night in a row, and uh, sometimes you can top a view. And I think we topped last night's view. Check our front door out tonight. Oh man, what a day. Dropped the bike a bunch of times. Um, we didn't get very many miles in, but they were good rocky, rocky passes that we went up. Two out of three as a wrap up. Um, the uh, DRZ just didn't want to get up that last pass and we could see the pass, it just couldn't get up there. And um, I mean, I guess we could have unloaded the bikes and uh, tried it then and saw if that gave it enough horsepower to get up that steep slope, but um, yeah, it just didn't seem worth it. I mean, this is supposed to be fun. And one thing I don't want to do is unload and reload luggage and come back down and carry that luggage to the top of the hill. So that's a no-go. Uh, Chris ate his meal, so I don't have a meal report. Rice and chicken, backpacker's pantry. I give it a B for meal, but I also I give it an A because it does taste like rice and chicken. So there is that. Mmm. I'm really hungry. Section two is in the books, complete, done. Everything's finished with section two. We've got a good campground here. We've got good neighbors. And again, that. That is an evening view. It is a bit chilly when we're camping. Uh, you can see I've got my hat out. I've got my sleeping bag liner. This is the highest we've camped, uh, 9,700 feet. Uh, so it's a bit chilly. Hopefully we won't freeze tonight. See y'all in the morning.